Good morning. Sorry about that late start. Still having my issues. One day I'll get over them. <laughs> Welcome to today's 10 minute meditation. Today we're going to focus on gentleness, which is perfect because I really have to be more gentle with myself when it comes to dealing with issues with the computers, issues with the projects I'm taking on. I mean, we are without a doubt our worst critics and we need to learn to be gentle and treat ourselves the way we would treat a child. Loving, nurturing, it doesn't mean we're weak. It just means, it just helps us to then treat others even more gently. So we're gonna focus on being gentle with ourselves today. We're gonna to start as always with the prayer of protection and the Lord's prayer. We'll go into uh, guided meditation a silent period, at the end of the silent period, you'll hear the chimes, <clears throat> letting you know it's the end of the silent period and we'll close with the 23rd Psalm. So let's get started. Take a deep breath, close your eyes and begin to relax. <clears throat> Take another deep breath and begin to scan your body and just notice is there any tightness or discomfort? And if there is, bring your mind's attention to that spot and invite it to relax and let go. Notice how it just releases, how amazing it is our bodies follow our mind's commands. And from this relaxed state, we begin with the prayer of protection. As I approach the throne of grace, beauty, and might, I throw about myself the protections found in the thought of the Christ. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. Let us just relax a moment and notice that beautiful stream of energy that's running from our head down to our feet. And it points in our body, actually going back up again, renewing us. So if you look at your body, you see all this energy moving down and around and up. You're this beautiful and energetic being. Bring your attention to that center stream that's flowing in from heaven and just allow your consciousness to rest in this stream like you're standing in a waterfall flowing through you. Feel the energy vibrating through your whole body. And in this relaxed, comfortable place, let your mind wander. Wander to this beautiful, island, quiet, lots of nature. Notice the sun just coming up, feeling its warmth on your skin, smelling the air of the water, the water smell, hearing a few birds, And if you look to your right, there's two beautiful trees holding a hammock. Walk over and notice this is the easiest hammock you ever climbed into. And just climb up there, settle in, and let the breeze gently rock you. Let the gentle ocean sounds 
move through you. The earth has a perfect rhythm. The universe has a perfect rhythm. The ocean has a perfect rhythm. Even the wind has a perfect rhythm. It just gently knows what to do, all controlled by the divine. And here is an opportunity for us to relax and gently go with the rhythm of the universe without any resistance. Allow yourself to just be. Know that that gentle rhythm is always a part of you. And at any time, you can close your eyes and just sit back in that hammock and feel the rhythm and the gentleness of the universe and calm yourself. Now we bring our attention back into our bodies leaving this place but bringing the gentleness with us. We pull in to become fully conscious of where we are. And in thankfulness and protection, we close with the 23rd Psalm. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He leadeth me besides the still waters. He restoreth my soul. He leadeth me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Thou anointest my head with oil, my cup runneth over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Amen. Thanks for joining me. Have a wonderful weekend, and I'll see you guys on Monday. Bye now.